We're going to work on the abdominals today, and that doesn't mean that all of the postures that we're going to be doing are contracting or squeezing the stomach area, but it means that we're going to be connected to our breath the whole time. So come to seated and we'll drop in, connect to your breath, move your hips around, find a comfortable seat, close your eyes, inhale through your nose, and out the mouth. Feel yourself arriving here, listening to your breath, dropping down, inhale through the nose. Exhale out the mouth. Close your mouth, inhale and exhale through the nose. Drink your breath in as you inhale. As you exhale, gently press the breath out, drawing your navel to your spine and letting your low ribs draw in, maybe even your chest draws down. Inhale through the nostrils. Exhale through the nostrils. Feel your navel and spine become closer all the way through the exhale. Inhale, release everything and float your body wide, tall. And as you exhale, draw in, feeling yourself a little more compact. If you ujjayi breathe, allow yourself to ujjayi breathe throughout the practice today. But what we want to stay focused on is this breath, the full exhales, breathing the breath out, feeling yourself empty, feeling your core compact, and then also taking deep breaths in and releasing any of the tension, any of the contraction. Take another breath here. Come onto your back. Place your feet onto the mat. Your hands facing down. Inhale, arch your back. As you exhale, tilt your pelvis so that your low back is touching, your tailbone is reaching up towards the knees. Inhale, let the natural curve come back in, maybe even exaggerate it a little bit. And exhale, press the navel to the spine and the spine towards the mat. Inhale, arch. Exhale, draw towards the mat. Inhale, arch. Exhale, draw in. Bring your hands behind your head. Interlace your fingers. Arch your back, inhaling. Exhale, draw your navel to your spine. Draw all the breath out. And with no breath in the body, let your head kind of float up. Elbows stay wide, not pulling the head, but letting the abdominals kind of lift the head. Lower your head, inhale, arch. Exhale, flatten your spine against the mat. With no breath, lift your head. Inhale, arch. Exhale, flatten. Head floats up. Release all the breath out. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, arch the back. Exhale, release it down. Lift your legs. Inhale here. Exhale, lower your right leg almost all the way down. Inhale, draw the foot up. Exhale, draw the left foot down. Inhale. Try and keep your low back touching. So only lowering your foot as long as the back stays connected to the mat. Not lowering it down so that the ribs pop up, but lowering it down 
so that you feel the abdominals working, that you stay connected to your breath, lifting your leg, lowering your leg with your breath. If you want to make this more challenging, you can do both legs at the same time, trying to keep the low back pressing against the mat the whole time. Move with your breath. If it's too much, have your knees into your chest and bring one leg straight and one leg in. So lots of options here. Take three more rounds. Draw your knees in, bring your hands around your shins, and squeeze, take five deep breaths here. Release your head, release your feet, come into bridge pose, stretch your belly. You can hold onto your mat, or interlace your fingers, press into your feet, stretch out the belly. Slowly release, draw your knees in, hold on behind the knees, rock back and forth. Don't let your feet come to the mat, but keep it balanced. Rock back. Rock up, come into bow pose. You can hold onto the knees or release, making it as challenging or as simple as possible. What we want is the spine straight, the hip flexors active. Inhale, exhale, bring your feet down, reverse your table. Squeeze the knees towards each other. Inhale deeply. Exhale, bring your hips down, cross your ankles, come onto your hands and to your knees. Arch around your spine with cow and cat pose. Make those same breaths, expansive inhales, completely drawing the breath out as you exhale. Come to center, flat spine, walk your knees in, and lift your right leg, toes facing down, hips square to the mat, and lift your left arm. Inhale here, exhale lower, inhale lift your right arm, exhale lower, inhale lift the left arm, exhale lower, inhale Reach the right arm, try and keep your chest and hips square to the mat. Inhale, left arm. Exhale, lower. Inhale, right arm. Exhale, lower. Lift your chin, lift your foot, draw your knee to your face. Inhale, extend it back and then lower the knee. Arch your back, inhaling, round your back. Exhaling, neutral spine. Lift the left leg, square your hips, toes facing down, left arm, excuse me, right arm reaches up and lowers. Inhale, left arm, exhale. Inhale, right arm, exhale. Left arm, draw in as you exhale. Inhale, right arm, exhale. Inhale, left arm. Exhale, lift your chin, lift your leg, exhale, draw your knee towards your face, extend it back, lower, walk your hands, the handprint forward, and come into plank pose. Three full breaths. Draw your navel to your spine as you exhale. Inhale. Exhale, lower to your belly, lower your knees first if you wish. Come into cobra pose and stretch the belly. You can stretch your throat as well, looking up. Lower down. Come into downward facing dog. Spread your fingers, lift your tailbone. 
Focus on the spine. Relax your head. Take full breaths in and out. Lift your heels, taking a full breath in. As you exhale, come to seated. Completely breathe out. Step or hop forward, come onto your back. Squeeze your knees to your chest. Bring your knees and hips at 90 degrees. Bring your hands behind the head. Rotate your pelvis so that the low back is touching. Lift your head. Extend the right leg forward and your right arm outside the left leg. Come back to center. And do the other side, exhaling, twisting. Come to center. Right arm outside the left leg. Left elbow maybe touching the mat. Inhale, center. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Drop your head down. Drop your feet down. Bring your hands by your side. Come into bridge pose again. Open your chest. Maybe draw your shoulder blades together. Lifting up more through the front side of your body. Press your feet evenly into the mat. Release, lower down. Draw your knees in. Start to rock back and forth. Maybe rock back and forth with your legs straight. Trying to find that same balance as you rock up. Finding a pause or not. <laughs> Rocking back. Trying to find that Balancing spot between your tailbone and your sit bone. Do one more. Pause. Squeeze your legs together. The bent knee option is always there. Holding behind the knees or reaching towards your feet. Inhale. Exhale. Lower your low back down. Keep your feet lifted. Reach your fingers to your toes. Push your low back down again. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, come back up, bring your feet down, come into a reverse tabletop, take three breaths. As you exhale, lower your hips, cross your ankles, come back into tabletop. Take cow pose, inhaling, take cat pose, exhaling, drawing all the breath out. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, walk your knees together, lift your right leg, exhale, tap your left, right arm, excuse me, inhale, extend, exhale, tap, same side, curl to that side, inhale, extend, Exhale, curl, two more. With your breath, breathe all the breath out. Crunch in as much as possible, not rushing the breath. Extend the leg, tuck your left toes under, hover the knee, send your hips up, send your right leg up, and exhale, step your foot forward. Come into a low lunge. Take a break off the hands. Stretch out the hip flexor. Take any positioning with your hands. Focusing on the left hip here so you can have your hands on your hips or over your head, anything that feels good. Bring your hands down. Lift the left knee. Step back, but keep the right leg hovering. So step to plank pose, keep it hovering. Bring your left heel down, come into side plank. The right foot can be on top of the left foot or hovering off. Activate your thighs. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, 
Bring your right hand down, keep the right foot lifted, and take a vinyasa. From downward facing dog, inhaling. Exhale, lower onto your knees. Knees close, left leg lifts. Exhale, tap. Inhale, extend. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. One more. Extend the leg, tuck your right toes under, lift the right knee hovering, and send the left leg up, three-legged dog. Exhale, step your foot forward, lower the right knee, low lunge. Couple breaths. Come back to your breath. With abdominal work, with moving quickly, our breath can get out of control. So spend another breath or two coming back to center. Bring your hands down. Lift the back knee. Come to plank pose with your left leg lifted. Try not to move your arms, but send your left leg back. Right foot comes down. Side plank. Thighs firm, both feet flexed. Take a breath in. Lower your hand, leg up, vinyasa. Five breaths. Lift your heels, we'll come onto our backs again so you can walk forward or hop forward, swing forward. Come onto your back, knees into your chest. Bring your arms to a T and your knees together. As you exhale, bring your knees over to the right. Inhale, come up. Exhale, knees to the left. Completely exhaling. Let the inhale bring you to center and the exhale over to the side. Try to relax the opposite shoulder so that when the knees are over to the left, the right shoulder is dropping down. Move with your breath here a few more rounds, making it more challenging by straightening your legs. So you can take this variation with your legs straight or your knees bent. Ujjayi breathe. Come to center. Hug in, lift your head, take three breaths. Take behind the knees or legs straight and come back into the rocks and rolls. Pause at the top, either with knees bent or legs straight, holding the legs or extending towards the toes. Shoulders drop back, full exhales. Take one more reverse tabletop. Lower your hips. Cross your ankles, come into plank pose. Lower to your belly. Come into Salambhasana. Interlace the fingers, lift the legs. Belly, breathe. Come into Downward Facing Dog. Last Downward Facing Dog.
come to seated. You can step or hop. Try to let that come forward be at the bottom of an exhale. Lift your arms and twist to the left. Twisting is great for the abdominals too. Imagine breathing out anything that's not serving you as you exhale. Even exhale fully and then at the bottom of your exhale, breathe out a little bit more. Full breath in, exhale. Inhale, come to center. Over to the other side. Twisting your spine. Take those extra deep exhales here. Maybe taking two like the other side. Inhale fully. Exhale. Come to center. Lift your arms. Bring your hands to center. Extend your legs. Come into a forward fold. And that might mean different things for different people. We want to kind of massage the organs here by touching the thighs and the belly together. So for some of you that means legs straight and for some of you that means even right here. Dropping your head towards your knees or anywhere in between. Take deep breaths here. Release, come upright on an inhale, and then sit cross-legged or any comfortable seat. You can sit kneeling as well. Take a hand on your heart and a hand on your belly. Feel yourself calm. Feel yourself connected to your center. The heartbeat is slowing down. The breath starts to become natural and unfocused, unforced. But with your hands, feel this organic movement here heart and the belly moving the hands. Feel the breath entering and leaving the body as it does all day long. Notice where you feel it, maybe in the tips of the nose or somewhere in the torso. Soften your awareness a little wider than yourself. Instead of only focusing on your breath, let there be mindfulness here. Let there be awareness of the breath. Notice what's happening around the body, the sensations on your skin, sounds.
this feeling of everything is connected, you and your breath, your skin and the air, yourself and everyone else. Bring your hands to your heart center. Bow to this inner fire within all of us. Bow to yourself, honoring your body, showing yourself gratitude. Namaste.